Don't don't hurt me though. Don't whoa, hurt. Whoa, whoa. No, 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 Bruce, watch out. Watch out. Oh. Hey, good morning everybody and welcome to the vlog from well not so sunny Mexico but it's gonna be good the weather's supposed to be clearing up it's raining just a little bit right now I wanted to tell you thank you for allowing me to take this break it is gonna be an absolutely amazing and much needed break but today we're gonna actually leave it in Noah and Eric's hands so who knows what's gonna happen together we're gonna have a great time watching let's go ahead and even though I'm not at the Reptarium or at BHB let's have an amazing day together yo what's up YouTube it's me bad choice no wait we're on my dad's channel today wait what's going on What's going this on This is Eric? weird. We got to keep it G-rated because it's the family program. <laughs> That's the family program, man. Okay. All right. So what are we doing today, Eric? I mean, my parents are out of town. They're in Mexico. You Viva know? La Mexico. I don't think they say that. I know. I just made that up. But uh, so I think what, what we're going to do today is kind of do a little check-in with all the employees at BHB, see what they're doing today, and uh, just get you guys filled in. Wow. I just got scared by Savvy. Just literally walked over my foot and... He wow. doesn't have a uh, personal bubble zone. He'll go yeah. right in it and exactly. step on your foot. So like I was saying, we're going to go around the shop, go to every employee, see what they're doing into the day, and just get a little piece of their day so you guys are entertained. So starting off with Eric, what are you doing today, my okay, fine so sir? yesterday we fed everything. So uh -huh. today I'm just going through, marking all the little charts here, yep. seeing who's eating, seeing who's going into breeding mode, doesn't right. want to eat for us. Cool, cool. Can I show you a snake real quick? Yeah, I know you love Pretty snakes. Pretty cool, I love snakes. I do like them. <laughs> <laughs> this is an exciting project. Now, we don't have any babies yet. We're going to be raising these up to breed. This is actually a het albino bull snake. Very cool. You see how weird they are? How yeah, they just want to back out of your hand. I know. You know what, what I, I mean? Was, I was just about to say, they are very awkward moving. They snakes, are right? very what, hard what to cut. <laughs> I just love these guys. When they get a little bit bigger, they just have that uh, more rougher kind of looking scale. Yeah. And uh, just kind of a cool attitude and a cool... <laughs> color variation from that black to kind of chocolate brown and I just like them I don't know I'm gonna let you choose it's just like the game of popcorn I chose yes. you so you choose next who are we gonna go see right now I choose Jessica all right I'm pretty sure that I've heard <laughs> that she was doing some skink breeding if I'm not wrong so probably uh, true let's go downstairs and see if she's down there the truth is guys I'm extremely lucky to have an amazing crew and of course Noah that are overlooking things back at BHB and the Reptarium and yeah they screw around and have a good time but the real truth is is that they really really care for my animals and they are absolutely amazing and that's what's allowing me to take this break and yes I really do need this break I feel like I was burnt out or really needing it. not so much but the fact is is after a couple years of day to night grind 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 I know that I needed this kind of break and the truth is is even just after a short period of time I already feel energized I cannot wait to get back I have all kinds of ideas I can't wait to share with you guys so it's absolutely amazing so I hope together we can have a great time watching the antics back at the shop down here with Jessica now and she's been working on the skink breeding this past little bit now and there are a couple pairings that she's trying on can you give us a little bit more knowledge on this so these guys are are Easterns Okay. He actually bred his first female yesterday. Wow, oh, congratulations, man. buddy. So hopefully we can no get him longer. to breed another girl. No he kind of likes the hypos, though. He doesn't really care for these guys. But How wow. funny even, is that? Even skinks have their own personal flavor, if you will. Yeah, oh my gosh. <laughs> That's crazy, isn't that is, it? That is crazy, honestly. Hypo. <laughs> See if he gets his freak on. <laughs> bow, chicka, bow, bow. Oh my! Let's that's not a, grab her head, that's, hon. That's a head grab. He didn't grab hard, so sorry. <laughs> <laughs> that's usually the thing to do before you get it on a good old headlock. Whoa. <laughs> Dude, Eric! <laughs> don't put that in. Don't put that in. But you can see he's definitely trying. So he's got to get her way up here, though, to actually do anything. But this is his first year, so he doesn't know exactly what he's doing, but he's trying really hard, huh? Well, <laughs> I could say out. something. <laughs> I could say a real <laughs> funny... All right, let's just go back to the... <laughs> All right, who knew skink breeding was so fun? Uh, no, I know. It's pretty incredible, actually. Why don't we do it? No, I'm just joking. We can't say that too loud. Jessica will make this our job. Yeah, that's right. That's, that's <laughs> true. Yeah. There's, I know there's a lot of babysitting involved because you can't really leave these guys over the weekend. You have right. to, like, you know, they make can, sure they breed, don't yeah. hurt each other, put them back. So. Oh, look, dude. He's getting a higher grab. Oh, he's grab. getting higher and he's higher. He's getting higher. Oh, my gosh. Oh, that's, that's a good grab. Oh, my that's gosh. That's a good lock right there. 
This is exciting. Let's Do go. It. Do Get it. it. Slide it in there, buddy. Can you see? What? Slide it in there? What? I can't say that. It's very graphic. It's very graphic. <laughs> Dude, I'm just rooting for the guy. Yeah, I, I Come hear on. you. I hear you. Slide it in. Yeah, sometimes. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> cool to see that they're definitely interested, yeah. right? I mean. So Jessica was right. The hypos is his thing, man. You put a hypo in there, he's just like, all right, let's go. So <laughs> weird. I think they're kind of camera shy because, yeah. you know, last time Brian came down here to film and nothing yeah. wanted to bring for me. That's weird. All right, well, That's there you awesome. go, Eric. We definitely had some fun times Sweet. with these things. That was more entertaining than I actually expected. Yeah. Um, yeah. He had some freaking some laughs with that one. I might have to come down here more Dude, often. Dude, I'm going to crack so many jokes and the camera's off. <laughs> And yes, this is the view from our hotel. Not too shabby, I gotta admit. You know, hey listen, we work really hard, so I figure if we're gonna take a break, we might as well really live it up. And it's been absolutely amazing. And I tell you what, I'm super excited to hear that the Easterns bred for the first time. We had a lot of our Northerns bred, and Jessica worked so, so hard to get these things bred. You cannot imagine. Without her, I would be truly lost. But I was excited to see that they actually bred. So again, it's cool for me to kind of watch along with you guys, because normally I'm in the vlog and I'm kind of filming everything. It's kind of cool to be the kind of a spectator. And this trip is really all about just that kind of mental break. Again, like I had mentioned before, it's not like I felt like I needed it per se, but I knew that if I took that break and shut it down for a little bit, that I would be that much more energetic and enthusiastic about the things that are coming up. And I'm still editing, I'm uploading, I'm coming back to you guys on everything, but this is truly amazing. And I thank you guys for allowing me to do this because I think this will be something that will make me super energetic over the next several months. Because like I said, I've been kind of brainstorming a bunch of things. And this few days has given me an opportunity to really think about them so when I get back I'll do a video kind of updating you guys on all of the cool things I've been thinking about doing in 2019. Eric at the Reptarium and we gotta check in with Bruce because the Reptarium is about to open and uh, yes very shortly. So uh, I saw him over here what are, you, what are you doing over here man? You got well you gotta do something over here? I gotta, I gotta pull Lucky out here because I gotta Eric, change, change his water and check for poops. So. Eric, Eric help out can you grab Lucky I can out help for him? him. I'm somewhat of a professional. Yeah, I know, exactly, exactly. So, so what you want to do is, is have 100% confidence. Yes, 100%. I mean, oh, ooh, you recently, ooh. Please, God, just don't. Tell him not to, will you? Stop it. Eric, Stop it, Lucky. Don't Eric, do it. You kind of have to hurry up because the reptarium's oh, opening soon. Yeah, pretty we're, soon we're, or what? How we're soon? On you guys. Yeah, we're waiting on you. And okay, this is I'll the last him. cage that needs to be cleaned. Before yeah, there we, we go, open. there we go. Oh wow. I got him. I got him. Look at that beautiful animal right there. Don't don't hurt me though. Don't whoa, hurt me. Whoa, whoa. Don't there, hurt me. There we go. All right, so you're holding him while he's just doing a little spot cleaning. There we go. I do love this animal. It's a beautiful animal. It is beautiful. Please, please help. Everything is just great. Please and, help. And the strike distance is actually incredible. It's pretty good. All They've right. got very long whoa. teeth. All right. Did you get it? Did, did, did you get it? Did yeah, you get yeah. The... All done. All, done. All right, there you go. I'm pretty sure he didn't even do anything. Yeah. yeah there's poop in there. there. Yeah. I did help. There you go. This is an amazing animal. Let's put him back in. Please don't bite Bruce. No, 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 no Bruce, watch out. Watch out. Ah! Ah. Oh, this is going to be the tricky part. Too. He did get you good. I felt the rip. Yeah. Please don't. <laughs> I felt the rip. He ripped right off him. Oh, my oh. God, he's going he vertical. He's going to bite me in the face. This is crazy. Please don't bite me in the face! Eric! <laughs> there he <All> goes. <laughs> Just like there in the is. wild. All right, good job, Eric. Now we're ready to open for the Reptarium. Thank you, Bruce. Perfect. <laughs> the weather hasn't really improved throughout the day. It's kind of been raining on and off, but that's okay because it's been absolutely amazing just to kind of chill out down here. And you know, Lori and myself really don't do a lot of opulent thing. We don't live like beyond our means and do a bunch of material things, but this is a vacation where we did want to kind of stay somewhere really beautiful. Obviously our room is right on the ocean. Uh, so it's been an absolutely amazing time. You've been having fun, Lori? Yes, very, very nice much needed lots yeah. of rest and relaxation so. yeah you know I always talk about how I work really hard but the truth is Lori works just as hard so uh, both of us have definitely needed this and uh, I tell you what it is just what the doctor ordered in the basement with Eric and Mary you guys have a little something that you want really bad is my correct dude I want it so bad double fingers crossed double that <laughs> You know what I mean? You just yeah. gotta cross them sometimes. Yeah, you, you I, hope I feel that. <laughs> BHP isn't gonna keep it to raise up to breed it. Yeah. I mean, I want them to, I want BHP to do good. 
Okay. Yeah, but you want yourself to do better. I that's, understand. That's You're what selfish. I'm no, no, I'm just joking. <laughs> <laughs> so let's take a look at this snake. What is this, Eric? Dude, this is a fire blade clown, and just wow. I don't know what it is. I love the clowns. Dude. Look at that. I dude. love I like, the clowns. It has that dark brown that goes to that very light brown. To that light yellow. gold, and I don't want to be yeah. mean to this little python. I'll try and like manipulate his head out here. Look at the head pattern on wow. these freaking clowns, man, and it's their like little a, eyeballs. It's a little caramel. It's like They're little so caramel. cool. I love these guys so much. Not too bad of a hallway, huh? And of course, at the end of the hallway, a pretty awesome atrium. Are you planning to like, when my dad comes back, like sauce him up a little bit, give him some like... Dude, I'm gonna be like, Brian, you're looking good. You're very exactly. tan. Very tan, yeah. Have you lost weight? Yes, dude. You're See, that's what you like gotta do. Caesar salad. Now we're getting that's somewhere, Eric. Now, yeah. we're now we're getting somewhere. Just keep thinking of more of those things. Dude, so you got you got a couple more days before you're they're right. back, you know. You're right. So I was thinking of banner. Compliments. A lot of compliments. He likes compliments. All right. Um, what is his favorite attribute? I don't really know, but I'll have to think about Probably it. Probably his let eyes, you know. because oh, I could stare yeah. into those beautiful okay. eyes like a dang uh, the outer space. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I think you got the python now. <laughs> yeah, you got it, man. <laughs> All right. Looks like we got a little guest in the lobby. <laughs> this thing is right. so sick. All right, guys. So the fire blade clown. I can definitely see why you guys want it. Thanks for uh, thanks for checking in with us. <laughs> one thing we do on every trip is just kind of pick one special thing. Like obviously in Italy, we were trying to find cannolis. Last time we were in Hawaii, I did the shaved ice. Where every place I went, I did shaved ice. So listen, I don't drink hardly ever, and I haven't been drunk in like 20 something years. But we decided that we're gonna try a different drink every single day. What is this one called? The lava flow. Lava, lava. flow. So uh, cheers. Cheers. Mm, that's good. That's tasty, huh? Yeah, this one's good, which means it's dangerous. <laughs> exactly. And uh, I'm going to have one drink. Lori might have several. You're going to have more than one. No, uh, no. Uh, one drink. No, no, no. <laughs> With Eric and Kelsey. And we're going to be talking about a little bit of breeding because that's what Kelsey is the expert at, you know? You know? I wouldn't call myself an expert. <laughs> hey, there's nothing wrong with just telling you a couple lies. You know? Oh, yeah. No, I'm, just, I'm, I'm joking. No, I lied my whole way. <laughs> I'm joking. Yeah. So, uh, Eric, what do you got in your hands here today? It's a black pastel lesser. Is that right? Yes. That okay, I was going to say cinnamon okay. lesser, black okay. pastel lesser. Yep. There you go. We're so there. Why do they call it black pastel? There's not even a single drop of black in that thing, man. That lesser's what? just going to drain it right out. I don't know a heck of a lot. That just that that's just coming from a, a, a non reptile guy. So yeah. uh, there's a chance it might be raining a little bit, and we are playing ping pong out in the rain. I think this is a this is your thing, right? It's fun. Yeah. I highly recommend it. The wind really helps the ball curl. So uh, and there was someone jogging out here too. Go figure. Only in Mexico. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's talk to the real person here, Kelsey. Give us some facts behind this two pairing right here. All right, yep. So um, she is already at 22 millimeters with her follicle wow. growth. So pretty that's significant, a, pretty especially this early in the season. And this is the male that she is being bred to. This is a Enchi pin banana. I don't know about you guys. I can definitely feel some tension here. <laughs> 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 I don't get it. Oh, I thought it was cool. Never mind. Hey, Eric. <laughs> Laugh to make you feel good. Yeah, Thanks. Yeah, that's what. That's Thanks. all. That's all. So, um, <laughs> wow, dude, this is a beautiful ball that you've got in your hand, though. It's a for real. pretty big one too. She's a pretty big girl. Yeah. So, um, Eric, do you have anything breeding at home? Uh, only our reticulated pythons right now. Wow. That's about it. We got a couple of dwarves, so I'm gonna try and. I've seen their defense mechanism. Oh my goodness. Oh my what gosh. The heck? That's a big tongue. That's oh my gosh. Woo. <laughs> I'm so mad at me. I tried to pair her with oh a male. My <laughs> that is crazy. 
So after, after oh, that was cool. That, yeah, that's great. It was pretty sweet. So is there anything else that you're excited about in this breeding season besides just this pair? Obviously, there's a lot, but oh yeah, yeah, I've got a ton of stuff that I think is going to produce some really cool clutches. Personally, keep, I keep it really simple. I'm hoping to produce some super lorries this season. Maybe some hey, super lorry pins. That's what's up. Super lorry leopards. There you go. Fingers crossed. There, good job, mom, on naming the snake the wrong thing. <laughs> now you got your own brand. <laughs> That's it, guys. We're just going to go ahead and enjoy the rest of this rainy day. Again, I had mentioned before, thank you guys for kind of allowing and sticking with me so that I could take this little bit of a mental break. We've had an absolutely amazing time, but we will be back tomorrow. Mexico is absolutely wonderful, and it's just what I needed to just re-energize and charge those injuries. And I hope that you guys have an absolutely amazing day, evening, whenever you happen to be watching. Thank you, as always, for all of your support. I truly, truly love you guys so much. Can you do me a couple favors before we get out of here? Can you smash that like button? If you like this video with the crew, can you turn those post notifications on so you know when I upload a video, which is every day, seven days a week, at 9 o'clock in the morning, Eastern Standard Time? Be kind to someone today, and I promise I will see you guys tomorrow. <laughs>